Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about multiplying radical expressions. So if I had to simplify this expression, 2 times the square root of 5 times the parentheses, the square root of 6, plus 2. Well, I'm looking inside this parentheses right here. Can I simplify anything? Not really. Um, square root of 6 is in the simplest form, and I can't combine it with the 2. Okay. So now I have to distribute the 2 square root of 5 to both parts. Okay. So 2 times the square root of 5 times the square root of 6 is just 2 times, and we combine it in 1 square root of 5 times 6. Okay. Then we multiply the 2 square root of 5 times the 2, the plus there, 2 times 2 is a 4, and then we're left with just the square root of 5. So now I have to simplify it. Can I break this down? Well, 6 is just uh, 2 times 3, right? So if 6 has 2 times 3, 5 can't break down, I have no pairs. So actually, um, there's no way I can break this down or bring anything out. So I think about, okay, 5 times 6 is 30. So I just have to multiply those together, and then that's it. I can't simplify anymore. So we have 2 times the square root of 30 here, okay, plus 4 times the square root of 5. And so that is just our final answer here of 2 square root of 30 plus 4 times the square root of 5. So let's recap. We're given 2 times the square root of 5 times parentheses, square root of 6, plus 2. We distributed the 2 square root of 5 with both parts, leaving us 2 times the square root of 5 times 6, plus 4 times the square root of 5. Now we try breaking down to see if we could simplify this and get a pair, but we can't, okay? It's worth trying sometimes. So 6 being 2 times 3 doesn't really help us, though. So we just have 5 times 6 there to become that 30. Everything else simplified just came down. And so our final answer here is just, again, 2 times the square root of 30 plus 4 times the square root of 5.